you were a child, what was it like when you were in school? What that kind was, of school did you go to? What was the first school you went to? Listen. What school? Yeah, what was the first what school you like? went to? What was your school like when you first Grade went to school? Grade school. Well, a one room, you went to a one room schoolhouse. Well, no, no, no. Uh, two rooms. Two rooms. Mm -hmm. and upstairs and downstairs. Where was that? Up in Packard. Uh-huh. And how many kids were in the school? Well, I'd say uh, primary, I'd here? be first and second grade, would be about 30. 30? In yeah. first and second grade? First and second Is that all that was in that school? Two grades? Yeah. Yeah? So you only went two years to that one school. One school, but then no, then you went upstairs. Oh, third and fourth. First and second were on the first floor. And third and fourth was upstairs. Uh huh. Did you have one and, teacher and, for both grades? And there was about maybe thirty-five upstairs. Okay. Was there one teacher for both grades? No. Oh, the, two teachers. Was one the room for, divided? One, one for first and second, and one for third and fourth. Uh huh. And how long, how, what time did school start? Nine o'clock. And when was it over? Four p.m. Ooh, that's long. <laughs> Nine to four. <laughs> and you didn't get out until you sang this song. Do you want to hear it? Yeah. yeah. <laughs> now the day is over, the night is drawing nigh. And the shadows of the evening steal across the sky. When in the morning I awaken, then may I arise. Pure, fresh, and sinless in thy holy eyes. Wow. Like Religious. <laughs> Boy, you wouldn't get away with that today. Oh, 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 no. No. My no, teacher is laying right over here near, near my parents. What was her name? Oh, Lou M. Angle, A-N-G-L-E. Your very first teacher? She was my very first teacher. Her first grade. And she lived neighbor. We lived neighbors up in Packard. That isn't the school that has the uh, tube that comes out of the no. front. Yes. Is that the one? Is that the school? Sure. The Packard in school. Oh, no, 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 that's... No, that's no. right. It's up on top of the hill. On top of the hill. The other hill. It, up towards a, the grandma. There's an old-timers club in there now. In your old school? Yeah. yeah. Old school building. Yeah. Uh-huh. Yeah. And so how many years did you go to that school? Well, I... Four grades. For four grades? Yeah. Okay. Anything else you want to know about that? Like what favorite subjects subject. you want? Yeah, what that's was your favorite I subject? Geography and history. Wow. That was mine. <laughs> Recess. What? Uh -huh. Recess. <laughs> <laughs> every year they gave you a medal. Yeah. Four. The, the two boys and two girls were picked. Uh huh. Did you get any? I got yes. It's a Liberty Bell medal. Wow. And you, you had to have at least from ninety-five. It's that time they gave you a number. Uh -huh. Ninety-five. To a hundred before you got one. Right. It'd be in that category. Uh huh. And how many did you get? I only had one. And one. All right. <laughs> Remember which grade? Uh, which well, grade? Second grade. The second grade. Yeah. Do you still have it? Yep. Do you really? Sure. Oh. Is that in the box? No. Uh, all no. Right. I I don't know what happened to it. I all right. My stuff. So I got okay. to go over it again. I have it though. I know it's there because right. it's, okay. it's long ago that I had it. Well, that's well, good. What was your favorite teacher out of first, second, third, and fourth? He just said his favorite teacher. He just said it. What's her name? One. He said her mm -hmm. name. Lou M. Mangle. And I'm named, I'm named after her father. Oh, oh, so she was a neighbor, too, or something? So they were neighbors. Oh. And my brother Ted, yeah, he was a great hooky player. He never <laughs> liked school. Which, which brother is that? Edwin. Which, he's right ahead of me. He was the old, just older than you. He's right ahead of me, yeah. And where and are you in the, in the boys? There were six boys and one girl, one right? Girl. Which boy are you? I'm number five. Number five out of... No. Out of, no. You're number yes, five you born? Number, you are. You're five. And I'm then number was four. Uncle Chip and then... Alma John. Raymond. Fifth born Raymond, or fifth boy? Elmer, Ted. I'm number you, four. I'm number four. I'm yeah, one, Raymond, two, three, four. Ted, and I'm four. And then, yeah, that one. Yeah. In the family, I'm number five. Myrtle, yeah, Myrtle, 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 Myrtle was the oldest. Okay. 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 Fourth boy and the fifth born. Yeah. All right. You were the fourth boy, but the fifth born child. Just okay. 
Uh, Justin wanted to know, when you were about his age, what were your favorite toy? Toy? We didn't get many toys. Yeah. But well, my favorite toy was a storybook. Ah, do you remember any of your first books? Oh, yeah, Hansel and Gretel and all that was in it, you know. Uh huh. They were like big books that had lots of stories that in them? Was a pretty thick book, yeah. Uh huh. Uh huh. Who gave you your books? My mother. Uh huh. Yeah. Did, you, did you go out and buy them somewhere, or were they were already in the family? They bought them. They went and bought them. Yeah, we were the fourth boy, so they had them for a while, probably, yeah. right? There was a lot of passed on down. Yeah. Hansel and Gretel, was that your favorite story? What? Was Hansel and Gretel your favorite story? Well, it was one of my favorites. It was in my younger days. Uh-huh. Okay. Do you remember when you started to read uh, by yourself? How, how old you were? Well, I'd be, I'd, be, I'd be I could read pretty fair before I went to school. Uh-huh. I'd be at the age of five, but easy, I could read pretty fair. Very good. Who read to you when you were young? My mother. Your mother? And my sister. And your sister? Yeah. And how much older than you was she? Let me see, 99, four years. Four years older than you. Yes. Okay. Great. Uh, Megan wanted to know, did you have any pets when you were a kid around her age? And what were their names? Tootie. Tootie? Tootie. What was that, a dog? Cat. A cat? Of course. Uh -huh. Oh, we had a dog too. We had a hound dog, Hank. Hank? <laughs> and then we had Was a he named dog. after Hank Williams? Huh? Was he named after the singer? I, I, I don't know. Ow! <laughs> Sing like Hank Williams. Huh? I doubt it. Not. Was that before Hank? Hank? That was that before around. Hank? Yeah, oh, yeah, oh God. Exactly. Yeah. 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 That's true. <laughs> Yeah, I can recall when the church bells would ring all the heat more and grow. He, he, he didn't like that part on his ear. Was he a hunting dog? Hunting dog. Yeah. Yes. Uh -huh. what, we had what, what did your cat look like? What did your cat look like? What, what color? color? All gray. All gray? Uh, heavy, With the stripes gray. like? And she was 14 oh, years old when she passed away. 14? Yeah, that's old. We had a regular service for her. We buried her under the cherry tree. Ah, uh, <laughs> just the kids or the whole family? Yeah. The whole family, or just you kids? Who who went to the service? Who did well, the service? us boys, the smallest of us boys. Uh huh. My mother. Uh huh. And you have a little cross for it too, or a headstone? Yeah. Like, yeah. Under the cherry tree, huh? Where did you live then? Packerton. Right, right in Packerton. I was born there. Up on the main street. The house is still standing. And how many houses were on the street? Was it? Oh well. I, I, I couldn't count them on the main street. It was, was it full? It was like a... Oh, yes. It like was here. Some, yeah. There was, in Packard, there was two churches, two saloons, <laughs> and two stores. <laughs> <laughs> and they're all gone. What, were, what kind of churches were they? It was a Lutheran and a, what they call a Reformed. Reformed. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Okay. That's great. Uh, Justin wanted to know... Uh, yeah, let's go through your brothers and sisters and name them for Justin. Who was born first? And well, there, was, the there was two born. Yeah, we could show the picture here. Why don't you show the picture while you do that? Yeah. You can point to who was born Justin? first. Justin? Died young. Okay. You want to know the, her name? Sure. Zella. Zella? That was her name. Z-E-L-L-A? Z. Z. -E -L -L -A? Z, -E -L -L -A. Z, -E -L -L -A. Z. No. Double L A. Uh huh. She was first. And how how long did she live? Oh, I would say only maybe a couple of weeks. A couple of weeks. Yes. Uh huh. Then then was Brother Elmer born in 1895. Where's Elmer? Here. That's Elmer on the end there. Okay. Okay. Oh, far right. Okay. And then was Brother Raymond? Raymond's next. Elmer lived up here in Lehighton for the longest yeah, time, right? Seven. Oh no, no. Yeah, he lived in Elmer for a while. They wasn't born in Packard. Oh, okay. Where were they born? They was born in, uh, the first one was born in Rockport. Rockport? I never even heard of Rockport. Weatherly, up near Rockport. Up near Rockport. Oh, okay. Rockport. Uh-huh. Then Raymond, Raymond, Raymond's the next one. Raymond was born in what they call, uh, above Whitehaven. I can't think of the name now. But 
it was right outside Whitehaven. Near mountain top, you can pretty near say. Okay, way up in the Poconos. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Okay. Then, then what, what was your uh, father doing then? What, what was his job up there? Car, carman. He worked for the shops. He worked, shops. he worked on the railroads back then, shops. too, in the shops. Okay. Yeah. Your mother didn't work, did she? No. Oh, Stayed at home. Oh, Had plenty of work at home. Plenty of work at home. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, then, then Raymond, he had it. He was second. He was born in 97. 97. And then my sister, Myrtle, was born in 99. Right in the middle, okay. And Edwin, he was born in 1901. Now, Edwin is the third from the right. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. Myrtle, Ted, his, his name was Ted. Everybody called him Ted. Yeah, you have to stay away from the camera. Ted. Myrtle was born Go Go just below the Tiger. The company had homes. That was called Brick Row. Yeah. They had brick homes, then down further toward the railroad. Did you have, is that what they, they had? They had frame homes. The, the uh -huh. company built them, you know. Yeah. And, and you had to like take the uh, rent out of their pay. Is that the That's way they used to do that? Yeah. Going up to the dam. Yeah. Going up to the Packard yeah. dam. There's only one of them standing. Yeah. There. yeah. So now this is their third homestead. Then they moved right? over yeah. the hill in Packard. That's, 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 That's the fourth. That's the fourth homestead. That's where. Then we were all born up there. Oh, okay. All the rest. So who's next after Myrtle then? Who's after Myrtle? Mm, you. Edwin. No. Ted. Oh. Ted, Uncle um, Ted. Oh, all right, Ted, and then, all right, I'm sorry, who's and that? Then, then Pappy. And then Pappy. Then, then Pappy, okay, and then who's next? Uh, 1903. Chip. 1903 is when they were born, March 26. March 26, 1906. 1903. And then who's next? Marvin. Marvin, Marvin. he's he the second from the left. He in, in uh, 1904, the very December the 30th. Or 31st. 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 New Year's Eve. New Year's Eve. Mm -hmm. He was born. The last day. 1904. Okay. And John, then there was a last speech of the No one. Uh, no, I missed one. Great. Marvin. Marvin, Marvin then John? Between, between Marvin, there was another one. 1906. Kenneth. Really? Yeah. I didn't know that. Oh. He died, sure. How he old was Kenneth? He died. How long did he live? I was still born. Oh. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Yeah. 1906. Wow. Then there was none until John, 1913. I didn't know about the other one either. Neither did I. Neither. 1913. Exactly. There was a big gap there then, huh? Yeah. Yeah. Uncle John. Yeah. 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 In 1913. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Great. Wow. So that was, uh, Eight times she gave birth. Eight? Nine. Nine, nine, nine times. Nine. Wow. Nine. <clears throat> Let's see what else. Um, well, let's tell, we were talking about your parents. We still didn't hear their names on this tape yet. What, what, were your, what was your dad's full name and what was your mother's full name? My, my father's full name was Henry Cross Barry. Well, that's where the dog got his name then, right? Hank. <laughs> Hank. <laughs> no, they never called him. They never called him. Well, they never him, called him Hank. Never called him Hank. Uh -huh. Hank? No. Oh, no. I thought they used to call him on the railroad. On the railroad? They call him that. Oh, sure. Oh, he knows that. Hank. And what was the middle name Hank. again? Cross. Cross. Is that a family name? Cross. 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 Yeah, where'd that name come from? I think it was on his mother's side. It was a family name. Yeah. Okay. And what was your mother's full name? Harriet Martha. What was her maiden name? Maiden. What was her maiden name? Sour Sourwine. Sourwine, right. Okay. Um. Well, well these are going to jump around a lot, so we'll just so I don't miss any. Um, Justin wants to know, when you were his age, what was your favorite food? Soup. Soup? <laughs> when you were his age, what, what kind of soup? What was your favorite food? Food, food. yeah. What did you he like? said soup. Rice. Is that what you meant? No, he thought you meant soup. Rice. Oh, no, favorite food. Yeah. Favorite soup. Right. It was vegetable soup. No, no, no. <laughs> what was your favorite food when you were Justin's age? What food. did you like yeah, best? What did you like, yeah. what did you like best? 
You remember? Rice. Remember? Anything. Rice soup. Macaroni. Pasta. <laughs> you ate what they put in front of you. Ah. Yeah. 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 Ye
That was a must. So you only wore your shoes during school. <laughs> the whole time. And then oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. And Sunday. Yeah. <laughs> That's great. Justin wants to know, what's your favorite animal? <laughs> what's your favorite animal? Name. Mickey. Mickey! <laughs> Mickey, hi, Daddy. Huh? Mickey. Do you have a pet yeah. squirrel yeah. out here? Right out here? Larry had it in the house. She came in the house. She, she had, had it in the house. She had it in the house for about three weeks. Oh, my God. Oh, it used to lay around. used to lay around. Lay around. Oh God. Larry would sit and hold it. Oh. It was just a little baby. Oh. He'd go over to what the cemetery it? and the squirrel. Sit on All of Judge's would sit on his shoulder. One day he just jumped off and went up a tree and that was it. Never came back. Never came back. Oh, God. He was a child. He found him over in the cemetery. He brought it home. He yeah. had it in here. He just put it on his shoulder and carried it home. He all all over here. In the morning, when he went to work, he took it along, took it over, and it hung on him until he went over there in the office. Mickey, that's squirrel. Oh, my goodness. Yeah. Megan wants to know, when did you decide to become an engineer? Well, that's a long story. Yeah, well, well I wanted to hear this whole story. What was your, when, when, and yeah, what I was your first job on the on the railroad? My first job was messenger boy. Messenger boy. Yeah. What did you do? Well, I used to go down meet the train to get the mail for the, uh, for the superintendent and the, uh, at the engine house, you know. And then, then I used to help with the time cards and things like that there, and run errands and. The, the general plumber go and buy his tobacco and run this and that. You know. <laughs> go, oh, get him. Yeah, do run errands. Go for it. Right? Yeah, go for it. That's it. Yeah. Yeah. But my. How much did you get paid? One dollar a day. One dollar a day. <laughs> How old were you? I was 15. That was when you first started. First started. That was a lot of money then. When, yeah. when did you join the union? Was there a union in that? In that? When you were 15 years old, was there a union? Oh yes. No. Who who belonged to the union? I I only was a messenger boy from May to September. Okay. Then the the company at the Hyden put on an, uh, an apprenticeship, right. a machinist. Right. And they appointed six of us. We got the job, 25 cents an hour. Mm, that's a big and raise. That was. And uh, look at the we worked different various jobs in the overhauling shop, then you went into the boiler maker, then you went into the machine shop for six months, and every six months you got two and a half cents an hour raise. So this was what your dad was doing, right? No, my dad was a carman. Oh, that's not car the same. Car inspector for the last, he was a car inspector. Inspector. You know, he didn't fix them, he inspected the yards them. and stuff. Okay. And that's those until. Was your dad still working when you started to work? Oh, yes. Mm -hmm. Oh, yeah. And Ted and, and Almer and Raymond, they were in the service. Okay. And Where were they? When Almer was in the Army. He was over in France. And Raymond, he was in the Navy. And this is World War One. One. I. Yeah. yeah. Okay. Well, that's not your name. So now you were too young for World War One. No. Not until the next year. Then I, after the war was over, then, then I quit. My right. father, see, my mother had died. I would have never dared to quit school. Right. Oh, no. How old were you when you quit school then? I got three dollars and some cents for one week work. So, so your mother died, you quit school, and then I, you went I, to work. Papa, you, he didn't care much about it, you know. You, you just left your go. But my mother would have, because Randy, I was, up, I was around average, uh, above average in mm -hmm. school. Mm -hmm. I was pretty fair. Mm -hmm. And she always says, you're one's going away to school. Mm -hmm. I never got it. She meant, I like, she meant the college? Is that what she meant by going I away to school? School or something. Yeah. Like that, you know, yeah. That's what she meant. Yeah. But, uh, and she died, and then uh, a year later, Pop, he decided to remarry and, and out in the country, six miles away, there's a hound in the world. Am I going to get back and forth to work? Mm hmm. So I settled it all. I went down one morning. I took a day off. I went down and I enlisted. Well, then I had to get had parental consent. So you had, Pop had a sign. Oh, he, he jumped six foot in the air. And I <laughs> <in> my papers. <laughs> then Ted cooled him down just like that. He says, Are you 16 years old now? I was six, 15, 16 years old then. Wow. And you could enlist when you were 16? I, I enlisted. But 
parental consent. Wow. Well, see, they they wanted to get him in. It was only a two-year enlistment. They wanted to get... 18 to, now, isn't it? They wanted to get men in to supplement the men that had, were in DOW duration of the war. See, they had to get rid of them fellas. Right. They were all complaining. Right. So they had to grab pretty near anything. And what year is this now? That was in 1919. This is 1919. Yeah. Okay. And then Ted says to Pop, he says, you might as well sign the papers. He goes, he'll run away and do something else anyway. And then he decided. <laughs> he took me down to the squire and he signed the papers. The squire. Yeah, you had to go in front of a notary. It's, it's like a notary public. Yeah. yeah. Uh huh. In front of that. Is he like a, a, a JP too, like a justice yeah, of the peace? Yeah, he was a JP, justice yeah. of the peace. Right. What they call it. Uh huh. Did you ever get brought before him for any other reason? The what? The JP. <laughs> you ever have to go see him for anything else? For anything. For yeah. One time. For what? Bad what? Boy. what? One time. What? What'd you do? Well, at work. Uh, follow the, 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 the company used to get things in the car, supplies, you know, mm -hmm. and... Uh, what car? You mean a railroad car? Yeah, they get their supplies, like for stationery and all that stuff in the, in the car. Right. And there were two fellas stole a bunch of lead pencils. Mm -hmm. And they gave me a couple, you know. I didn't know where they got them. Uh, and I, uh, and I, you were I, caught I was in with the fellow who took care of the <laughs> storehouse. Right. And I gave him one. He, Gee, that's a nice pencil, and I gave him one. Oh, he recognized they, it. They went and traced that pencil back, and well, one day the cops come there and they wanted to talk to me. Well, they had me. For well, a they pencil, took me to huh? the squire, but our father has a record. Oh. For a pencil? Yeah, yeah. It was we didn't do our father has a record. Was it? Gee, I've you, tried to do what you this. Told we're him. finding things out on the record. Yeah. We didn't know but that. But he believed what you said, right? No, he know what he said. Yeah, the other fellas admitted it. The, the that that they took it and gave it to <laughs> they you. They admitted it that I, I didn't know nothing about it. That was good. That was good. Did they lose their jobs? No. No, they didn't. Really? No. No, they they, they, but they had to pay for the pencils. Well, they right? had they had a job. They had a hard time getting the men to do it. I was spraying the engines when they after oh. they were, the fires were clean and stuff. You know, they sprayed before they went in the engine house. Oh, they helped. Uh, yeah. No, that was a messy so job. Right. And <laughs> they, they, they laid them off, though, for 30 days. Oh, okay. They laid them off. All right. But you had no punishment? No. 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 Okay. <laughs> okay, Randy. That's a good story. Randy? Like Are we near we the end? One last minute of the tape, yeah. One minute. Okay. Um, well, I want to ask more about, about the, uh, yep. the union stuff. So. Something quick. Yep. The. Always take. This is a good time. Yeah, we have only three seconds left, so we'll just. Yeah, we'll just. Okay.